Those tanks look kind of tough, don't they? I guess you think you wouldn't have much of a chance up against those babies. Well, you're wrong, see? Now, get me straight. They're tough, all right. I'm a tanker myself, and I ought to know. But don't get the idea you can't handle those blitz buggies just because they're big and they make a lot of noise. <laughs> Actually, you guys got the edge on them if you know how to play your cards. I guess I shouldn't be telling you this because I'm a tank man. But what the hell, we're all playing on the same team, ain't we? I figure a tanker knows more about tanks than anybody else. We know where they're strong. And brother, they are strong. But we know where they're weak, too. That's what I think you guys ought to know about. Even if I do give away some trade secrets. Okay. What is a tank? Well, you might say it's a GI can on tracks that carries a lot of firepower. Its job is to smash through you guys. Rip you up so you'll be duck soup for the enemy infantry that's coming on behind the tanks. Now, this is about the way the job lines up. You knock out as many tanks as you can, and at the same time, protect yourself so you can mow down that enemy infantry. The tanks got weak points like anything else. The track is one of them. A mine, or a shell, or a lucky hit with a grenade can blast off the track. And to the guys inside, a busted track in battle is usually good for a $10,000 check to the folks back home. Sure, sure they still got firepower left, but they can't move. And when they're standing still, they make a target that's hard to miss. Now here's another weak point. We don't see too good out of these rolling pillboxes. So we keep the flaps open down here for the driver and the hatch open for the tank commander. That is, we keep him open if the enemy's dumb enough to let us. If he's half smart, he'll turn a stream of rifle or machine gun fire at us. Then we got a button up. Now we don't like that. Now we got a weak point in our tracks. And we're three quarters blind when we're buttoned up. Here's another weak point. We're big. And we can't hide. So we gotta plow through and take whatever they heave at us. And believe you me, it's no fun sitting in one of those hot boxes with that stuff pouring at you. Listen to that. That's enough to make a man nervous. Brother, they ain't cream puffs. We're a hell of a good outfit, just as tough as they come in any army. But we don't like being shot at any more than you do. And figure it this way. We're a lot easier to hit than you are. Okay. Now you know how to crack a tank. Remember, you're not Superman. You can't stop a tank with your bare chest no matter how much hair you got on it. It takes good common sense. And it takes guts. The one thing not to do is to run. Because if you do, brother, I'm telling you, you're a dead duck. And last of all, get this. A battlefield is a hell of a big place and you can't see the whole thing. Maybe all you'll see are the guys right around you. Riflemen, just like you. Don't get the idea that you're out there all alone fighting this war by yourself. You got a lot of stuff pitching for you. Big stuff. Just because you're playing the line and can't see the backfield doesn't mean it isn't there. It's there, brother. And it's fighting for you all the time. Artillery, any tank guns, mines, planes. And don't forget you've got tanks on your side, too. And don't forget that. Your big job is to tear that infantry apart. Well, if you don't mind, I think I'll have another beer.